I wanted to make a video talking specifically to people in Florida who believe in the Constitution, specifically the Second Amendment. If you believe in the Second Amendment, if you're a gun guy and you live in the state of Florida, you need to wake up. There's lots of things going on right now. Obviously, you heard that last week, or you should have heard that last week, um, what actually happened in the state house here in Florida is that they put a bill on the desk of the governor that it's, it's, um, it's pretty comprehensive gun control in my opinion. And Governor Scott signed that bill. Some of it is already in effect and the other more egregious parts of it, the, the, you know, the parts that are already in effect are bad enough, other terrible parts of it are going into effect in October. But that's not the end. I think we need to pay attention to what's happening right now in Florida. And I'll give you an example of why. Over the weekend, Mac, Military Arms Channel, he sent me a message that he got from one of the people that supports him on Patreon. And it was saying that every 20 years in Florida, the Constitution actually can be amended. And that he heard that what was happening in Florida is that there were going to be gun control amendments slipped into the Constitution. Mac reached out to me to ask me if that was true. I was not even aware that every 20 years we, we could actually legally change the Constitution. So I went and looked it up and I found out, yes indeed, every 20 years the Constitution gets changed. This is that year. As a matter of fact, we are literally days and weeks away from these things taking place. Okay, and then when we looked further into it, we found out that there are indeed several gun control measures that people are trying to sneak into the Constitution. The way that that happens is that if it, there's, there's something called the Florida Constitution Revision Commission, you guys need to go research that and look it up. Because our politicians right now, when we got these, this bill that Governor Scott signed, that was actually Republicans that allowed that bill to come out of committee. They supported it, they voted yes for it, and then a Republican governor signed it. That same thing is happening, and this time, so that we don't push back on them, they're being very quiet about this, and they're sneaking this into bills. Um, I heard there's something called Marcy's Law, which I believe is a victim's rights um, bill or law that has been passed in, in a few states including California, and they're trying to slip stuff into that, right? Because the way to do it is to have a Trojan horse that everyone's going to agree with that victims should have more rights and then slip gun control laws into that. There's, there's also several other ways that they're going to try to do this, and they're being very quiet and very sneaky about it while you guys are being apathetic and asleep at the wheel and not realizing that more and more gun control is coming to Florida. As a matter of fact, these guys, in my opinion, are competing to be more restrictive than California or New York. And this is going to happen if you don't wake up and pay attention to what's going on. Look up the Florida Constitution Revision Committee. Look it up. See what's going on there. Get in touch with your reps. Get in touch with Governor Scott. The bill that we already have that he signed into law on many levels is in unconstitutional. Now, this is the reason why they're trying to change the Florida Constitution. And the time is now to do this. From just me finding out about this over the weekend and looking it up just now, I realized that for the last 20 years, people have been trying to slip gun control things into it. If that happens, if anything gets on the ballot, we have a very high chance, a high likelihood, that people will go and vote for these things and then it becomes Florida Constitution. Okay, if you're a gun guy and you live in Florida, and you care about what happens here, you care about the Second Amendment and what's going on in Florida, you need to wake up and pay attention. I know there's lots of other things going on. Everyone wants to go to the beach and have a good time and enjoy spring break and all that kind of stuff. I get it. But if you don't do something about this, we are going to lose our Second Amendment rights in Florida. That's one of the reasons why I live here. I don't know about you, but I don't want to live in a state like that. Now, I can wait until it happens and then run away or I can fight for it right now, and so can you. So I'm asking you guys to get together with me and fight and push back against this. Talk to your, uh, to your reps and find out what they know about this. Look up the Florida Constitution Revision Committee and pay attention to what's going on in Florida. Okay, we're going to try to keep you guys as posted as we can on this. All right, let's wake up now and start fighting. I'm Hank Strange.